This is AZ Coder. I'm going to demonstrate the latest version of my radiation scripts that I had originally written back in 2015 for the Shadowfall campaign. I've now completely rewritten it, and I'm going to take a box of uh, Arma Aftershave, which is known to be highly radioactive, as you can see here. That's how you set it up, and we're going to see the effects of that. One of the new additions is that NPCs can now get sick from radiation. Actually, the player can get sick as well. But by sick, I do mean sick, as you can see in the video here. In the version written for Shadowfall several years back, only the player's team and the player, of course, could get sick from radiation, whereby I mean taking damage. Uh, one of the major changes now is that any uh, AI or other life form, for that matter, that gets within a high radiation zone like that cologne is, will take uh, damage and actually get sick from it. One of the other major changes that you probably already noticed is the UI, which displays a Geiger counter. Previously, it was just a hint box on the screen, which showed the millisieverts going on around you uh, automatically. Now, an uh, actual UI pops up, as you can see, and the green light on the upper right corner means that the sound is turned on. By default, Shift-Z will turn the sound off and on. You can go into add-on configurations, just look for my radiation mod and you'll see the shift in there. You can bind it to any key you like. When an AI unit takes damage from radiation, it will actually run off, as you saw earlier. For some reason, this AI decided to return to the source of radiation. I might have to do some tweaking to prevent that from happening. And as you'll see, he does pay the price for it. Another effect that I actually didn't expect uh, until I made this video was a rabbit showed up in the background, and he took a lot of radiation damage and killed over as well. And that's pretty much all I have on this. Thanks for watching.